In the vast expanse of the world's oceans, there roam a few modern leviathans known for their sheer size and potent capabilities. Aircraft carriers. The heart of these colossal vessels often holds an equally impressive source of power, a nuclear reactor. The integration of nuclear propulsion into these giants has not just been a technological marvel, but also a strategic masterstroke, fundamentally revolutionizing naval operations. However, it is essential to understand that this impressive feat of engineering comes with substantial costs and responsibilities. At the core of a nuclear-powered aircraft carrier lies the nuclear reactor, an advanced and incredibly powerful piece of engineering. This reactor provides a virtually unlimited power source, allowing these carriers to operate at high speeds for extended periods without the need for frequent refueling. However, the impressive capabilities of these vessels come at a high cost. Building a nuclear-powered aircraft carrier is estimated to be around $13 billion, not to mention the significant expenses associated with maintenance and eventual decommissioning. This seemingly endless energy supply offers a significant tactical advantage. Unlike conventional carriers which are dependent on a steady supply of fuel, nuclear-powered carriers have a vastly extended range and endurance. This enables them to maintain a continuous presence in strategic locations across the globe, ensuring rapid response capabilities to emerging situations. The exceptional power output of the nuclear propulsion system enables these vessels to support a greater number of aircraft, thereby increasing their overall firepower. The absence of a need to store large volumes of conventional fuel also frees up substantial space. This extra room can be utilized for additional aircraft, weapons, and other critical systems, thus enhancing the operational capabilities of these carriers. Another key advantage lies in the environmental perspective. Nuclear-powered carriers, while requiring careful handling due to the inherent risks associated with nuclear energy, emit no greenhouse gases, making them a cleaner option than their conventionally powered counterparts. Nonetheless, the management of nuclear waste from these carriers is a complex and challenging issue, given that the waste remains hazardous for thousands of years. Moreover, it's crucial to consider the potential risks associated with nuclear propulsion. While the chances of a nuclear accident on an aircraft carrier are very low, the consequences could be catastrophic demanding the highest levels of safety and risk management protocols. The advent of nuclear propulsion in aircraft carriers, beginning with the USS Enterprise commissioned in 1961, has been a game-changer in naval warfare. The strategic advantages of operational range, endurance, firepower, and even environmental considerations make these nuclear-powered giants, 11 of which are currently in service with the United States Navy, a powerful presence on the world's oceans. While it comes with its challenges and responsibilities, the adoption of nuclear power marks a significant evolution in the capabilities of aircraft carriers. However, the substantial costs, the management of long-lived nuclear waste, and the potential for catastrophic accidents necessitate a balanced understanding of this technology. As we sail into the future, these nuclear titans will likely continue to play an important role in shaping global naval strategy and power projection. The fusion of nuclear technology and naval engineering truly embodies the spirit of innovation, fueling the endless dance of strategy and counter-strategy in our vast seas, albeit with careful consideration of the inherent risks and responsibilities.